that resource library. So we're in the groundwork manage resources section and we're going to create what are called resource tiles. These are containers that all that group all of your like content together. You can have as many resource tiles as you want within any section or chapter of groundwork. So you want to make them pretty narrow in their focus. Um, they need to cover really one topic and contain all the resources about that topic. So in this case, we're going to be working on our Microsoft Office resource library, and we're working within our PowerPoint media section. And so we're going to talk about editing videos in PowerPoint. So the title of this resource is Editing Videos, and we're going to give it a description. We could try, did you know that PowerPoint can edit videos? And we could be more descriptive if we wanted here. Each resource tile can contain a video and links to additional resources. So for our video, uh, in this case I found a video already hosted on YouTube that explains how to edit video. So we just grab that embed code straight from YouTube and we drop it into the resource tile. And then we can include additional links. This could be links to how-to PDF files, Word documents, uh, additional video files, uh, uh, links to external websites, downloads, whatever you want to, to put here. We'll be real simple um, and we'll include a link to Google for no particular reason. So we just put the title of the link and the link itself separated by a comma and we'll put another link. So just return and uh, let's put a link to Microsoft's website. We could include as many links as we wanted, and when we're happy with everything, we simply add the resource. And you can see here it's added into our resource bank. We could actually click on any of these resources and edit them, um, prepare them, uh, do any, delete them, change any descriptions or titles. And once we build up a bank of resource tiles, we can insert them into our plugin, and we'll do that in the next video.